Hello guys, I've been looking online for a gas mask, but they seem to be rather expensive. And since I have no money and I am a cheap bastard, I decided to make my own gas mask, you know, just in case. First we will use a bottle. I'm using this Coke Zero bottle, but regular Coke should work as well. Just make sure it's not glass. Now remove the label and make sure you throw it on your sofa. Cut the bottom of your bottle, like this. And make sure the size of the bottle fits your face. Now we have to cut a hole for your face. So make sure you cut out the part that has the glue. Otherwise, you will feel like an idiot afterwards. Now that you creep everyone out, cut off the pointy edges. Ah, much better. Keep trimming until it fits your beautiful face nicely. Guys, I realized that throughout the whole video, I was breathing through my mouth. So I will look like an idiot for the next 10 minutes. Now, the main ingredient for our mask. I bought this fridge deodorant in a department store. Just make sure the main ingredient is active charcoal or activated carbon. We use activated carbon for the filter, since it has a huge surface area. Basically, this carbon will absorb all the impurities in tear gas or onion gas. So once you finish struggling with the plastic wrap, proceed to extract the interior. Now remember, no matter how good this looks, do not eat it. I also bought bamboo charcoal, which is not active. We can actually see some difference between the two. Now we have to remove the top of this can. I use a knife to do this but you can also use a spoon if you feel confident on your skills. And I broke it. Now we will use our beauty cottons that all of us have to make layers inside the can. Yep. That hurts. Now pour some carbon and proceed to create the next layer. Repeat as many times as you want. Be generous with the cotton. Now use some tape to secure the top layer, so you don't have to worry about any spills. You never know when you have to do a handstand. Now try it, and if it's like the salt containers in every f***ing restaurant, then you're good to go. Trim it down with your scissors or your spoon until the bottle gently touches the cotton. Now that your can is smoother than a baby's butt, we will join the bottle and the can. First, I use some tape to hold it in place. Then I seal the edges.
Now try it and check if it seals. And because I'm an idiot, I forgot to make the holes before doing everything else. So with a very small knife, we're going to poke some holes on the bottom. Not at the sides, in the middle. Now we're going to tape the edges so that it is more comfortable and also seals better. Amazing. Truly amazing. Now poke some holes so we can tie some rubber bands to hold it against our heads. If you have a freaking big head like me, you might need to tie two rubber bands together first. Then make sure you tape the holes so there is no leaking. And finally, show it to the feline and see if she approves. Alright guys, I am going to try the mask with an onion. Because if I was in the US, I probably could buy pepper spray or tear gas in any pharmacy but unfortunately it's illegal to buy it here in Hong Kong so we'll have to make it with an onion so guys right now I can smell the onion I can smell that delicious onion smell but it's not making me want to cry at all Yeah, it doesn't hurt at all. Let's chop it really fine. Guys, I can really smell a lot of onion. The smell is there, but not the, the feeling that I want to cry. It's not burning my eyes. Yeah, I definitely can smell it, but it doesn't hurt. I want to take off my mask now and see how it affects me. Wow. Oh, yeah, it's a lot. I will keep chopping it. Oh, ha, <laughs> oh, that is intense. Um. Oh. Oh yeah, feeling it now. Oof. Oh god. Oh. <laughs> oh. I just bought it. Oh, you going for Hong Kong? Ah. Yeah, now I'm feeling it. Oh god. It burns. Uh, guys, I'm going to do the onion challenge. So, take a plastic bag. Ah, uh, onion challenge for Hong Kong, guys. Put all your onion in a plastic bag. Uh, yeah, I, I can tell that the masks really makes a huge difference. Oh God. Ah. Uh, so now <laughs> ah, ah, yeah, it hurts. Oh holy shit. <coughs> yeah, it is quite similar to the smell of tear gas. Ah oh, the sensation is is quite similar when you put your head inside oh god ah. Um, so tear gas for those of you who haven't experienced it. No, Momo, get out of here. Yeah, so basically what I was saying is that uh, tear gas is like onions from space in steroids. And you can put a lot of chopped onion here and give few deep breaths inside the bag. <coughs> oh. 
Oh. Yeah. Oh. All right, guys. Of course, I have to try the mask directly inside this bag of onion. Anyway, let's try it inside this. That's amazing. Guys, like, I was breathing inside the bag with onion and uh, um, before I could only take like two breaths and I had to come out because like my, I, I just wanted to throw up and cough. But with this, I could, I actually felt like I could keep going. Uh, you still can get a little bit of the sensation when you breathe with this inside the bag of onion. But, the, uh, this, the difference is enormous, it's seriously, seriously useful and I think we, for this we actually could make it a little bit better, uh, seal the sides better, we could even use a plastic bag to wrap it around our head so we have no filtering at all and uh, we can add so many more layers of carbon here, we can actually use a longer can, we could use two cans on the sides, so it's my first time making this uh masks and it seems that it's working really really well i am i am actually very surprised so i'll keep one with me and see if one day if i meet the cops on the street and they decide to shoot uh tear gas i am going to try my my mask but at least now i know that we can make a cheap alternative uh to those gas masks and it worked really really well so yeah i'm I'm amazed, I'm surprised, and oh, I'm still affected after breathing in that uh, bag of chopped onion. But guys, if you want to try how it feels to get uh, to breathe tear gas, it's not exactly the same, but I would say it's quite similar. Chop a lot of onions, put them inside a plastic bag, and breathe inside the plastic bag, and uh, you'll get a quite similar experience. And let me know how many breaths of onion gas you can uh, have inside the plastic but tell me uh, tell me in the comments and let me know if you would like to get one of these if I make a few more I'm probably going to be sending them to my followers so let me know if you want one and also let me know how do you go with the onion challenge for Hong Kong uh, I think for me I, ha I only could take two breaths inside the plastic bag before I had to rush away from it so Guys, thank you for watching. See you all in another video. Take care and bye. Adios.